In 1911, photographer Louis Hine captured a series of heartbreaking photos that exposed the harsh reality of child labor in Maine sardine canneries. Hine was hired by the American Child Protection Council to document the working conditions and exploitation of children across the United States. He traveled to Eastport, a small town in Maine, where the sardine industry was booming and children were being employed as cheap labor. The photos reveal the grueling tasks these young workers were forced to perform. For just $1.50 a day, many children worked as cutters, responsible for chopping the heads and tails off freshly caught fish. Inside the factories, the work was demanding and dangerous. With sharp knives in cramped and slippery quarters, the children were incentivized to work as quickly as possible, often resulting in painful cuts. Heinz images captured the sad and blank faces of these child laborers, as well as their wounded hands. The photos served as evidence for the American Child Protection Council, leading to the successful implementation of a new law prohibiting children from working in factories. Eastport, once a thriving trading port, relied heavily on the sardine industry. By the late 19th century, the town had 13 sardine factories, employing around 800 men, women, and children. However, as the fishing industry declined, so did the town's economy. Eastport eventually went bankrupt in 1937. Join us as we delve into the heartbreaking story of the child workers in Maine's sardine canneries and explore the impact of Lewis Hines photographs on child labor laws. These powerful images serve as a reminder of the importance of protecting the rights and well-being of children in the workplace.